god, what is this thing? Security here is state-of-the-art, quite impenetrable. Unless, of course, you flew a drone through the window one of Mary's mouth breathers left open. The recording device is in her security room. Getting there should be a simple matter of navigating the vents. What the hell? She's using these people as house servants, against their will. Horrible in itself, but a million times worse knowing they end up as unwilling organ donors. Let's see what kind of recording we've got on her.
just look at this place. This is what comes of old crooked money. The Kelly family has been profiting from people's misery for a long time. She's got this shit all over the manor. So you've been in there before? Is that how you ended up in the basement of the Southwark incinerator? We needed something incriminating, so we decided someone had to get in here and plant a bug. I wasn't going to assign someone else to do that. You saw how Mary uses the people she grabs out of the EPC, and the staff's uniform's not hard to mimic, so I went in. What I didn't know was that she had intel on our investigation, my team. I thought going off book would stop the leaks, but she still knew we were coming. She tortured me for the names of my team, tried to break me, but cops don't give up cops. Turned out she already knew the whole unit and put hits out on them. <laughs> the woman is a mind fucker. Oh, God. I'm sorry. You're lucky she didn't plant one of her microchips in you. But then, she probably knew you'd rather die than be her slave. That's how I ended up on that butcher's table. So many reasons to want to rid the world of her, but... It wouldn't be enough to just put one in her brain. My mates died trying to bring her to justice. I have to honor that.
to yourself after everything I've done for you. You made me a slave. All of us. Please, let me go. Take this thing out. Back to your old life. Back to nothing. Back to you. 2.5 screaming blighters in your dead-end job and sucking off the doll. You don't want that, love. This microchip is scary, I know, but I've got to keep tracks on my merchandise, don't I? And this kitchen knife, that won't do it, love. Cutting yourself affects my bottom line. You walk. I can't live like this anymore. No. You are right there. It's all right, sweetheart, because I have another use for you. Be sure and spread the word. You know where this one goes. Get these two and all the others over to the venue and ready for the sale. Right away, ma'am. Also, the foreign investors have already landed and the drones are programmed, ready to deliver the invitations and the coordinates to all the guests. Mm, it's that initiative I'm smelling, Peter. Initiative can be a dangerous thing. Can be misinterpreted. How did Mary get her hands on this kind of tech? It takes a sick mind to come up with killer microchips. Perhaps a diseased mind, but definitely an ingenious one. Perfect psych profile for a group like Zero Day, wouldn't you say? Her affiliations aren't my priority, Bagley. She's keeping these people enslaved. And it sounds as if she's selling them. This is huge. Clever. Despicable, but clever. The microchip lets her enslave them. If they step out of line, zap. Organ harvesting time. Dead sec. We'll have to crash that slave auction. Get all the information we can out of there. The location will be on the invitations. She hasn't sent out the invitation yet, but when she does... Bagley, monitor the drone networks. Give us a heads up when Mary sends out her fleet. Until then, I reckon we're in a holding pattern. I'll get in touch if I hear about anything else that might interest you. Cheers, dead sec. My mum would be proud. I'm kicking ass. DedSec is fun. You wouldn't have been recruited if DedSec thought you'd be killed that easily. All right. Thank you, Bagley. I guess. What would a resistance be without a cocky little AI shit? He will grow on you eventually. Since we're waiting for our cordial invitation to Mary Kelly's tasteless theme party, we can finally get back to what really matters, solving the mystery of Zero Day. Who are they, and why did they frame DedSec for the bombings? What have you found, Bagley? Glad you asked. Today, the great AI detective has two leads for his dog's body politic. Obviously, Albion needs looking into, but I also have a more unusual thread for you to pull on. There's a new hacktivist group on the dark web scene called the 404. But instead of being in it for the lulls, this lot seems to be in it for the brutal reshaping of society by any means necessary. Sound like anyone you know? Sounds like we have options. I've marked both on your optic. I've found a potential recruit for you. Drop in a pin on your map.
I didn't see a thing. And I wouldn't tell a soul, I swear. It's all right. Breathe. I'm not going to hurt you. You mean you aren't with Albion? Oh, thank God. My heart was about to burst. Hey, it's all right. We're here to help. What's your problem? Oh, I've got a target on my back now. I was doing some graffiti when I stumbled upon some Albion goons. Those monsters had tied up a few protesters and were beating them within an inch of their lives. Jesus. I tried to hide, but the bloody place is littered with cameras. I may have been caught on one. What if they come back? If I'm on those tapes, I'm done for. Please, if you can gather up all the evidence before Albion does, I may stand a chance. All right, we'll look into it. I've got the location from her GPS, and there's a load of CTOS surveillance around. Any number of cameras might have seen her. Let's have a look. Here's where our friend witnessed the Albion crime. The security footage should still be on site. Great. Suspect I'll get the data. Over. We have reports of a hostile in your area. Proceed. Over. Don't now. Out. That's the CTOS up there. on the suspect. Anyone see the suspect? Terminating the search. Control. 
Put out an APW. Yeah, there she is. Clearly identifiable, too. If Albion saw this footage, she'd be pretty fucked. Damn. However, Albion's crime was also clearly recorded, which means we can turn this footage back around on them. We just have to wipe the backup file from the central CTOS servers to protect the witness's identity. Send me the location, please. There's quite a few Albion goons in the server room. Either the perpetrators beat us here, or you've just stumbled on a fascist book club. That's not good. We're probably not the only ones after this evidence. You'll have to beat them to it.
There's the terminal. We can do the intrusion there. This will trigger a heavy security response. I grabbed the evidence from the server and scrubbed the local copy. No way they'll identify her now. Now get out of there so we can tell her the good news. You are the least of Albion's concerns now. Are you serious? Oh, thank God. I thought I was dead. I owe you all a tremendous debt. Hey, you know what? You're exactly the kind of person DedSec is looking for. You should join us. It's fun. Right. Count me in.
You joining us is totally awesome. Welcome to DedSec. Brilliant. I'm not ready to go to pasture yet. Let's get to it. Brilliant. Putting Mary Kelly on the back burner while she continues to destroy lives with those microchips, but for now, we've no choice. Then perhaps it's time to have a closer look at the elephants in the room. Nigel Cass, billionaire warmonger and current CEO of our local horde of thugs, Albion BMC. Cass certainly profited most from the bombings. We can inspire London to resist from now till forever, but it still won't break Albion's grip on the city. Not with Cass at the top. And you want to what? Invite Nigel Cass over for a nice cup of tea and a chat about how he runs Albion. Tell me you have a plan. Otherwise, we should just shoot ourselves and save him the trouble. Bagley's come across a possible gap in Cass's armor. An ex-insider, ex-friend with an axe to grind. He'd be an asset if we can find and convince him to work with us. Come to the safe house. We'll talk it through.
how you're doing. I hope you don't mind me getting situated in your safe house. Crime marches on, and so will I. There are still cases that need to be closed, if you'll help me. Leave it to me. Excellent. I uploaded a case to Bagley. He can brief you on it. Kelly's been sending a ton of crypto to an unknown party in Cairo. Something to do with Kronos X. Oh, that dark web designer drug. Yeah, I've heard of that. During my totally non-illegal research. <laughs> it's a highly addictive psychotropic with a staggeringly high fatality rate that stands to make Clan Kelly a lot of money. And Clan Kelly doesn't care about the human cost. Well, the phrase Finsbury New Project keeps popping up in their comms if you'd like to take a look into it. Working with the police now. Sounds stupid until you really think about it. Then it sounds fucking idiotic. I hear you, but this girl's shown she's got a brass pair. She's not your typical copper. You know what's typical? Your lack of sense. Police are fucking police. Better a Bobby than one of those Albion prats. I think our girl may surprise you. I tell you what, mate. End of the day, I won't be the one who gets fucking surprised. the only British organisation to successfully oppress more of the developing world than the British government. Led by Nigel Cass, a man the partisan media calls a charismatic visionary, and Amnesty International calls a war criminal. Albion was given the key to the city to re-establish order following the bombings. Quite fishy, if you ask me. It is. So that's two reasons why we need to find an angle on Cass. we found one. His name? Hamish Balaji. Born in London, Bellagi was a recipient of the Cass Foundation Technical Scholarship at 14, which included a mentorship with Cass himself. At 16, Bellagi designed Cass's first drone fleet. Fun fact, Cass delayed the launch by a week so it would land on Bellagi's birthday. Cass sounds like Bellagi's second dad. Why would he help us? They had a falling out after an incident in the night at Delta three years ago. A buried human rights investigation accuses Cass of ordering a drone fleet to wipe out a village protesting the construction of a pipeline, but the drones malfunctioned before they could. Bellagi is named as the likely saboteur. He's been on the run ever since, but now tracking data shows he's reappeared in London. Shit, he's looking for redemption like with the protesters. This guy designed Cass's drone fleet. I think he's trying to disarm Albion. He covers his tracks well, but that's a good guess. Unfortunately, according to this Albion intelligence report, intercepted by our friend Caitlin Lau, Cass knows Bellagi's in London as well. So, that's the op. Make contact with Bellagi before Albion finds him. Then convince him we have a mutual enemy in Cass. So this guy's our best chance to stop Albion and clear our names. And the largest private army on Earth wants him dead. No pressure. It took some doing, but I've narrowed down the area where we're most likely to find Hamish Bellagi. I've pushed the coordinates to your optic. 